It's the big one, Game 7 of the World Series between the New York Yankees and the Arizona Diamondbacks. Here we go, it's Game 7. Here's your line score from 1 through 6 games. It's a 3-3 tie. Everybody's on deck. Your pitch is going to be Kurt Schilling versus... Roger Clement, they both 1-0 in the World Series. Yeah, and by the way, go get the roster. 2001 Diamondbacks, Yankees at the MLB show the boat. Well, here's your lineup for the New York Yankees. Let's see how this is going to turn out. Can Kurt Schilling win it all for the Diamondbacks or the Yankees have other ideas? But here comes the infield and the outfield for the Diamondbacks. This is how they line up. Well, the crowd is pumped up. Everybody's ready. Derek Jeter, let's get this game started. Derek Jeter, the move towards the batter's boxes. We're just about set to get underway tonight. This is sharply hit back up the middle, and the leadoff man is going to reach here. He's got a base hit. Paul O'Neill will step in now. Now he turns on one and rips it down the line. Step on the back for one. Throw back to second, and that's a double play. Bernie Williams will get his first shot at it here. Swing and a liner towards second. And that'll get down for a two-out single. Tony Martinez will get his first cuts here with two gone now and a runner at first. Here he comes again, one-two. And an off-speed pitch, swung on and missed, and with that, the side is retired. Good job by Kurt Schilling. It was a tough inning, but he got out of it with no runs. Ryder Clement, can he bring it home to Mama for the Yankees and win Game 7? We'll find out and see. Here's the Diamondbacks lineup. Tony Womack is coming up first, and the crowd is ready. Everybody's pumped, 0-0. Zero, zero. Let's get the bottom of the first going. Let's do it. Tony. Womack. Fastball swung on and missed for the first out. Greg Council will get his first opportunity now. And the throw will take care of him, so it's a brisk start to the home first tonight as there are two away. Luis Gonzalez will get his first opportunity now with two away, and the base is empty here in the home half of the first. And he didn't miss that by much. It's popped way up on the infield, and I mean way up there. Martinez is there, and the side is retired. So nothing in the Arizona first. Jorge Posada leads things off now in the top half of the second. Now the first pitch. And a good first pitch as he gets him to bounce one on the ground out towards second. Throw to first will be in time, and there's one gone here to start the second. Shane Spencer will take his cuts now. Now here's the pitch. Now a swing, and he pops him up right up the chute. This may be tough behind the plate. And two quick outs here in the second. Alfonso Soriano will stand in here looking to keep the inning alive with two gone now in the top of the second. And try to hold up in time but to no avail as he went around and the inning is over. Matt Williams will start things off in the bottom of the second. And the pitch. Now the fastball is right by him as he swings and misses for the first out of the inning. Steve Finley will be the batter. Goes the other way as this is line to left. And a base hit in the first one of the game so far for the Diamondbacks. Danny Batista will take his first cuts of the ball game here. He's running towards second. Pitches a cold strike. The throw. Tag put down by Soriano. He is out at second base. And a good fastball swung on and missed for strike three, and the inning is over. Scott Burgess ready to go here as we begin the third. And he swings and hits this ball high in the air and deep to left center field. 
Finley is going to get back, and he'll put this one away on the warning track for the first down. Roger Clemens will be the batter. Roger Clemens. Now here's the pitch. Now a swing and a miss here as he's down on strikes. So it's two up, two down to begin the third. So bases are empty here with two gone. And in steps Derek Jeter. Now here it comes. This now is hit to second. Does he have another 1-2-3 inning? He does. Seven in a row he's set down now as the side is retired. Nothing across here this half. Mark Gray will stand in. Here it comes. Out in front as he yanks this down the line at first. No problem here. One away. Damian Miller will stand in for the first time here. And now a fastball is roasted into left field. That's a base hit. He'll take the turn and head for second. And now this is thrown wildly, just getting it into the infield. Kurt Schilling will take a long look down here as he may be bunting to avoid the double play. And they elect to have the pitcher bunt with one gun as he puts this one down. Only plays to first, so the pitcher does his job as it's a successful sacrifice. Tony Womack will stand in here. He was set down on strikes to start the home first. Good lead off a second there, now the pitch. And a breaking ball swung on and missed, and the side is retired. Paul O'Neill will stand in now to get us going here in the fourth. And this is swung on and missed, though he will need to do a little housekeeping at first. Throw on to first is in time to get him, so that'll go down as a strikeout and a 2-3 to three put out for route number one. Bernie Williams will stand in. A base hit his first time around. Now here's a changeup that's pulled toward right center field. And a long run, but he gets there, and that's good range in the outfield as there are two gone. Tony Martinez will stride in again. He struck out swinging his first time. The pitch. Swing and a miss on the breaking ball, and he sets him down for out number three. Greg Council will lead things off here in the home half of the fourth. The 2-2 coming. And this is swung on and missed, and this fourth inning will start the same way he ended the third with a strikeout, and there's one away. Luis Gonzalez will dig in. He popped out his first time. And the first pitch to him is bounced out to Jeter at short. On to first, and there were two down. Matt Williams will try it again. Set down on strikes his first time. Here's a hard hit ball back up the middle. And he'll turn and try the jump throw to first. The throw will not be in time, as I don't think he was going to get him anyway, but a fine effort nonetheless. Steve Finley will dig in. He singled his first time. Here's the first pitch. And he'll go the other way with the fastball as this is on the ground to third. A flip over to Soriano at second, and that'll end the inning. Jorge Posada will make his way towards the box to lead off the fifth. Swinging on the first pitch as he hits this one on the ground to second. And the fifth inning will start with a ground out, one away. Shane Spencer will dig in. He popped out in foul territory his first time. And this is swung on and missed, so it's two up, two down to start the fifth. Alfonso Soriano will dig in here. Took a called third strike his first time. And he struck him out his seventh of the ball game, and that ends the inning. Danny Batista will stand in to lead things off in the bottom of the fifth. to the shortstop Jeter. Throw to first by Jeter and there's one gone. Mark Gray will stand in. He grounded out his first time. He takes strike three called on the fastball. Couldn't pull the trigger and there are two away. Damian Miller will step in now. And he struck him out, his seventh of the ball game, and that ends the inning. Scott Burgess will start things out for the Yankees here in their half of the sixth. Swinging a ground ball to short. 
throw to first gets him, so the leadoff man's retired here to begin the sixth. Roger Clemens will stride in again. He struck out swinging his first time. And the middle infielders are staying busy here. Another ground ball, this time out to second. And that is through into right field for a one-out single. So the shortstop, Derek Jeter, will dig in here. One for two. He's singled and grounded out so far. Now a big swing, and this ball is crushed. Deep left center field. Forget it. Long gone. Home run. Well, when you start relying on one pitch out there and you become a one-pitch pitcher, there's no doubt in the hitter's mind what's coming. He's sitting on this one all the way, and he launches it right over the wall. So a two-run shot for Derek Jeter, his second home run of the series, and this is now a 2 to nothing lead for the Yankees. Paul O'Neill will stand in 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. Oh, and he's waiting on the fastball that time as he belts one high and deep to right center. Leaps, and he made the catch! He took one out of the stands! Santa Maria! Oh, and this is just highway robbery out there in center field. He's got a long way to go just to get to this thing. But look at the concentration as he goes up and over the wall to take away what would have been a home run. O2 pitch is swung on and lifted in the air out to center field. Finley will get there and he puts it away to retire the side. The Yankees get a couple on the two run home run. Through five and a half, it's now 2 0 New York. Reggie Sanders is going to come off the bench as he'll be asked to lead off the bottom of inning number six. Swing and a miss, and he's got that strikeout pitch working now. That's three in a row for him as there's one away. Tony Womack will stand in, and he, like so many others, hitless in the ballgame so far. May get four strikeouts in a row as this is swung on and missed for the second out. Greg Council will try it again. He's grounded out and struck out in two trips. First pitch to him. That's out to left. Does he have another 1-2-3 inning? You bet he does. 11 in a row set down, and the inning is over. May get six shutout innings as he continues to give them fits out there. Bobby Witt is on the pitch now as he'll take over to start inning number seven. Tony Martinez will stand in here to start the seventh in a game that's been sailing along to this point. Swing and a hard hit ball towards the hole. And that's through into right, so a leadoff single here to start the seventh. Jorge Posada will stand in again. A couple of ground outs for him on the ledger in his two trips so far. From the stretch. That's hard hit back up the middle. A step on the bag for one. On to first, and they turn the double play. Shane Spencer will come forward now. He's popped out and struck out in his first two plate appearances. Now a hard hit ball back up the middle. And that is through into center field, a base hit. Alfonso Soriano will get another shot. Struck out swinging his last time. Swing and a ball hit out toward right center. Batista is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. The Yanks leave one. They're up two to nothing. Luis Gonzalez will step in now to lead off the home half of the seventh. Now a fastball, and he might have gotten under it just a bit as this is out toward deep right field. O'Neill is there, and he has it for the out. Matt Williams will dig in now. Hitless in his two at-bats so far. Swing and a liner toward right center. Base hit. 
around first, digging for two now. And he's in there easily at second with a one-out double. Steve Finley will step in as the possible tying run, but just a single here could make this a one-run game. Now the 2-2 pitch. And he struck him out. The tenth victim set down on strikes thus far. Danny Batista will dig in for the third time now. He struck out and bounced out in his first two trips. Now a ball hit hard towards the hole. And from deep in the hole, he got him. What a play, and that ends the inning. One left for the Diamondbacks. They trail things here two to nothing. Mike Morgan will be summoned from the bullpen now as he'll take over to start inning number eight. Scott Burgess will get us going now in the top half of the eighth. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. Roger Clemens will stand in. A strikeout victim his first time and then a base hit last time around. Now a swing and a ground ball. Fastball right back to the mound. And he'll just flip this on to first for the second out of the inning. Derek Jeter will stand in again as we flash you back to earlier. He's accounted for their only runs of the ball game on one swing of the bat as this was the swing right here. First pitch here is popped a mile high into the air. This is way up there, but playable on the infield. Gray has got it, and the side is retired. So no runs, no hits, no errors, and no one left. Not too many more shots left. Home half of the eighth coming up. Mark Gray will try it again. He's grounded out and struck out in two trips. Now here's a ball hit hard on the ground to second. And Soriano will throw on for out number one. Damian Miller will dig in. One for two to this point in the ball game. The pitch. And he puts a pretty good jolt into this one. High and deep to center. Williams is back and he'll get there to make the play for route number two. Jay Bell will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. 2-0 on the way. And this is hit well towards the hole. And that is through in the left field. The base hit. Tony Womack will stand in. And they've done a good job keeping him off base at the top of the lineup. He's 0 for 3 thus far. He's set. Now the pitch. 2-1 pitch is swung on and hit in the air out to center field. Williams will get there. And he puts it away to retire the side. Troy Braun come on now to start the ninth inning as he looks to keep this deficit right where it is for the bottom of the ninth. Paul O'Neill will get us started as they look for a little insurance here in the top of the ninth. Now here's a swing and a little dribbler in fair territory out in front of home plate. Throw on to first for the out and that is how the ninth inning gets underway. And there you see what could be the final three batters in this baseball season as they'll be given the assignment of trying to stay alive here in this World Series. Bernie Williams will get another crack, one for three thus far. Now a fastball, and it's hit on the ground is short. Throw gets him, two down. Tony Martinez will step in, a base hit in his last time. Here's the pitch. Big swing, but a little dribbler here to the right side of the mound. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Pretty painless half of the inning, all told. Two, three, and four set to kick off the bottom of the ninth. The Yankees lead it two to nothing. And on to try and close things out here in the ninth. Who else? Mariano Rivera. Greg Council will stand in. He flew out his last time up. Now a swing and a hard hit ball to short. And a close play at first, but a great stretch that time as they get him by a step for out number one. Luis Gonzalez will stand in, needing to do something here to get on base as they're down to their final two outs. And this 
is in the air now, out to left. Spencer is there, and there are two men gone now. Matt Williams will stand in as their last chance now. And the pitch. Now a line drive here. Around second. He'll try for third. The relay. Well, he is in there with a triple. Steve Finley will get a chance now as he hopes to cash in following the two-out triple. And this storied baseball legacy can add one more chapter. The Yankees are again champions of the world. Well, let the celebrating begin. This is a World Series for the ages. And it came down to a Game 7, but all along, I really felt like this was the better team, and they proved it here. They are the world champions. And there it is, the Yankees win the 2001 World Series. Oh, man, it took seven games back and forth i was sweating the yankees were sweating the diamondback was sweating but the yankees came out on top it was a well-deserved roger clement wins the mvp he won two games 26 strikeouts and no earned runs let's take a look at some highlights Derek Jeter gives the yankees a 2-0 lead in the top of the six with a bomb shot paul o'neill tried to do a back-to-back -back, but steve finley took it away from paul o'neill and robbed them from a home run. Bottom of the six, here we go. Roger Clemens cruising, strikes out Sanders with a fastball. And the bottom of the seven, he strikes out Finley with running on scoring position. And Mariano Rivera closes the door with a man on third. And the Yankees win the World Series. Well, thanks for watching all seven games. Make sure you get that roster. It's under Gordis 23 JL at the MOB to show the bowl. Make sure you get that. I'm doing another World Series classes. I'll reveal it later on. Well, till next time, I'm out. Take care. Peace.